Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel Technocats. In today's video, we will learn how to make a single rung alternate button. Means if suppose uh, we have one input and one output, we program in such a way that when we press button, the output turns on. Again, when we press the same button, the output turns off. So let's see in the Lady logic, logic here. So I have one input named x0. Sorry, uh, right mode. X zero as an input. The rising edge. Uh, sorry, rising edge of X zero. Now, O U T output Y zero need to turn on. Uh, y zero and C. Sorry, L. Y zero and C here. One more uh, line row. I will write here x so is by zero input. Oh, sorry, okay. by zero is on. Then x zero. Take a rising edge and NC of the exit rising edge. Yes. So let's transfer this. Then X0 is my input and the Y0 is my output. Now if I turn X0 on, that is 1 my y0 turns on that is true if i turn this off now the y should y0 should remain on when again i will press x0 that is 1 the y should 0 y should uh, sorry y0 should be false or 0 see y0 is false now this again 0 yes on press once y0 is true x0 is Unpressed now. Now again press X0, the Y0 is false. So, this is how the alternate button works, and this is using a single uh, rung here. The other method is just remove these, uh, no, remove this. You can use M1 or M01 here. I will use uh, five zero here. So again, I will delete five zero. The second method which we are using right now, x zero. That is again the rising edge. U T M one. If I turn next zero on, Y zero is true. Again on, Y zero is false. Again, X zero is on. Y0 is true, X0 is off, Y0 is already true. Again, X0 is on, Y0 is false. So, this is using the second method. And there are several combinations where you can uh, use the logic and uh, perform the alternate button operation. So, it depends uh, totally on the logic here. So, this is all from today's video. If you like my video, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.